everyone and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be looking at some more custom content for The Sims 4 by my good friend uh, Grim Cookies who I've made a couple of custom content packs with Grim. He's an amazing custom content creator and this time he's teamed up with Savvy Sweet and Savvy Sweet is another amazing custom content creator and what they've made is awesome and I'm going to show you guys what they've done. Also I'm going to show you a streamer set and also a fashion set that Grim has also made separately to this uh, just because I think they're awesome and I wanted to show you guys what he's been up to. So let's first have a look at this pack by Savvy Sweet and Grimm. Uh, it's a very like fiery pack I have to say. There's a lot of bright colors, uh, really edgy pieces, um, but at the same time they're all kind of basics which means you can put them with a lot of items that already exist in your game. Uh, so this is the first uh, look we're going to be checking out today. Now these boots are actually from the Deligracy and Grim Cookies collab that uh, I did with him. You can download that off my website, but everything else is uh, from their collaboration. So we have this mini skirt. And by the way, I love the thumbnails for this too, because it's got like a neon light going through it. So this is the skirt. And then we have like a cropped hoodie here with drawstrings uh, that looks like it's kind of being cut. I, I absolutely love the green actually. I think it's sick. Uh, so there you go. That's what that looks like. And they've also made this choker here, which I think looks really nice too. Let me find it. Uh, it's like a, a metallic choker. So it comes in rose gold, a very rose. No, actually I'd say that's a bronze, a rose gold, a gold and a silver. And it's just a really, really nice metallic texture. Now I want heaps of metallic stuff. I want furniture in metallics. I reckon that would be awesome. So that's the choker. And then there's this amazing hair, which I love. I don't have anything like this in my game. And I know Grimm's been wanting to do like a real uh, solid cut bob and I love it. So this can obviously be in lots of different hair colors. And if you have downloaded his uh, add-on accessory, which is usually for this hairdo, uh, you can actually dye the edges a different ombre color. So I, I personally really like the ombre, but of course, if you wanna take the ombre away, you can just have a natural colored bob or you can put the ombre back there uh, to brighten up a bit. And they've also done this eyeliner here, which is quite pretty as well uh, for a bit of fun. So you can get that in white, gray, blue, green, of course, black, uh, lots of different colors there if you wanna have some fun with it. And this lipstick's also by Grim Cookies too. So that is, that's the first look. I might go back to the pink, how I styled her initially. Uh, then there's also a more casual look here. This bun wasn't actually part of the pack, but it is a recent hairdo by Grimm as well that you can get off his Patreon. Really, really, really nice. And I love it. I, I love a good up bun, you know? The, the amount of videos I filmed with my hair up in a bun, this is great. And it has more of this detailing right here, so it'll suit more sims. Uh, so I think that's been really nicely made. And then I didn't put any makeup on her. I just went with this plain cropped t-shirt, which of course is part of the collaborative pack. So that's really nice in all of these different colors. She looks so good in that, in that mango color. Then there's these cute little waisted shorts uh, with drawstrings as well. So very cute, elastic at the waist and then they're just, they're really nice. I like this kind of aged gray color as well, but it's really beautifully made. Like you can look at the shadowing around the, the butt cheek, <laughs> the inner butt cheek <laughs> and the temple of life here. Um, it's really nice shading, very nice. So there you go. There's a basic t-shirt and shorts for you. I'll put it in a few different colors as well so you can check it out. Uh, so, so really nice stuff, really, really very nice stuff. Let's jump to another look, which is this look. Uh, I love this. I love a, a cropped set of, of, I don't know, like a turtleneck and a skirt. I love it. So these are separates. It's not a full outfit, um, but it's got like a corduroy stretch fabric, I think. Uh, so yeah, lots of different colors here. This sim looks amazing in all the colors. And then this is the matching skirt that you can pair with whatever you want. But of course this top goes with the skirt perfectly. 
So I think she looks pretty good in this. And then this is a recent Hair Grim Cookies released too. Really, really pretty. Uh, I didn't actually realize he had released this. And when I just saw it on his Patreon, I was like, oh, I need that as well. So gorgeous long hairdo. But I've got to say, I think my favorite is, I love the forest green. I'm a forest green kind of girl. So looking very, very nice. Then uh, here's another look. This is a corduroy skirt. I love the lining on the pockets and the hem lining and all of that detailing. I think it looks so nice. Again, I've teamed it with the boots from the Deligracy Grim Cookies pack just because I think it looks so nice together. And then this is actually a full bodysuit. So if we remove the skirt, uh, we can see the bodysuit here. So it'll tuck into whatever you'd like. Very nice and still got that stretch fabric uh, look and feel about it. And this hair is also part of their collaboration and it's like a braided bob, would you call it? Really, really nice too. Looks awesome. And they've done such a great job with this. So let's show it in a few different colors. This one doesn't have an ombre to go with it. Uh, I mean, I don't think it really needs an ombre. I think it looks, I think it looks really nice uh, in the natural colors personally. But that's that hair, so very nice work. And then last of all, this is another Grim Cookies hair from a while ago, but we've paired this top with these flared corduroy looking pants or jeans. And of course those come in all of the colors you would expect as well. So really, really nice. Did I skip one of these? I feel like I missed one of the hairs. Oh, we totally missed a hair. Silly me, we missed like one of the best hairs that are in the pack. This one, how cool is this? Okay, this is pretty amazing. Uh, so this is a long braided hairdo and it even has the bits coming down the front. Really, really, really gorgeous. And look at how detailed it is. They've done such a great job on this. And for those of you guys who like to spice it up a little bit, it does have an ombre um, effect at the bottom as well. So you can have that balayage look. And I love that this comes not only in really bright colors, if you want that bright colored look, but it also comes in, you know, the more softer, more natural colors as well. So you can go from blonde to brown or brown to brown or, you know, whatever you like or to a reddy color. Uh, I think that looks really, really good. So that's what they've been working on. Excuse me if I've missed anything, I might have, <laughs> but I think they've done a really great job on this. And then let's uh, let's jump into looking at what else Grimm has been up to. Okay, so these are two separate downloads uh, or little packs, I suppose, of items you might be interested in having in your game. Uh, this first one is, ooh, we're speeding up time, is a streamer setup, which I was really excited about. Uh, so you get key lights, a camera, a new computer. You guys might have seen me using this computer a lot because it's my favorite computer in my game now. <laughs> and a mic. So if you want your sim to be a YouTuber or I don't know, someone who records podcasts or whatever, whatever your storyline is, you can get this set up. And it does usually come with a different desk, but for some reason in my game, I can't get the desk. I don't know why. If anyone knows a fix to this, please let me know because the desk looks absolutely beautiful, but I can't put it in my game. Uh, so I've just had to use like a base game desk here, uh, but just to show you guys, these are all separate items. And this is a, a full on light, so you can change the colors of it. Here's my favorite computer screen and they don't need any other swatches. There's no other swatches that come with them and they obviously just act like a normal light that you'd have in the game. Uh, let's set this light to, I don't know, purple. If you want like a purple look for some reason, computer does all the same things as you would expect it to do. The sim is really tired. <laughs> so that's pretty nice. I, I love that set. Oh, honey, let's just get your camera over here. Uh, so you can film your DSLR. And then this other pack here, this is really cool. This is like a wardrobe fashion pack. And this will let you create your more fashionable Sims or Sims who might be quite wealthy and have every handbag in a different color, really make them come to life. So uh, the best thing about this is all of these items are separates. So you can pretend that your Sim has like the ultimate 
design a bag collection in all of these different colors. And these, uh, these are like tables that stack on one another. So you can have them standing still or stack them. They can have all of these different pairs of shoes. They can have a sneaker collection if you want. All of the shoes come in a few different colors as well, which is really nice. And you can also collect the shoe boxes too. I don't know if your Sims would keep their shoe boxes. I know a lot of people like to keep their shoe boxes. I actually saw clear shoe boxes at Ikea recently. They're just like Perspex clear boxes. And I was like, if I ever had a designer bag collection or designer shoe collection, I would want them all in like perfect see-through crystal boxes or Perspex boxes. And I love this bag design as well. This just, this looks like your classic designer, designer bag design, uh, designer bag design. And then this is uh, obviously a new A-frame dresser, which is nice too. So this comes in a few different colors and swatches to mix it up a little bit. And then a nice thing is underneath it, uh, it kind of acts like a shelf almost. It has slots for objects. So you can perfectly put your shoes underneath it, stack it that way, have your shoe boxes. Why not stack a couple of shoe boxes under there? You can do that or slip it under underneath this object. There's just so many slots for placing the items in. It's, it's quite refreshing because often with EA's shelves, as we all know, or tables, there's not enough slots. So you can put like one thing on a shelf and you're like, oh, that's all. <laughs> uh, also loving these boots too. So your, your Sims can have all of their, their boots there. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys those few things. Uh, I'm really proud when, well, as Grim is a friend of mine, I'm really proud when he creates new items or collaborates with someone else. And I certainly love to have these items in my game because they're always a really nice high quality and perfectly maxes match. So of course I want to share it with you guys. Uh, let me know what you think in the, in the comments down below and uh, do check out Grim's video uh, if you want to check that out and Savvy Sweet. Uh, if you want to go support them on Patreon, highly recommend because Grim is always releasing new content. And I'm not sure how often Savvy Sweet creates content, but I assume they're working a lot on new pieces as well. So it's always nice to be updated when something new comes out. Um, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. And I look forward to speaking to you all soon. Tack, tack.